Let's simplify this expression. We work with bed mass. We work within the brackets and we see that we have a number negative 54 divided by two. Negative 54 divided by two is equals to, if I type it in properly, negative 27. So we have this is equal to negative 27 on the numerator and we have x to the sixth divided by x to the negative three. When, the, when you have the top part divided by the bottom part with the same base, we simply subtract the exponents. So we have x to the six minus negative three. We're subtracting top, num top exponent minus the bottom exponent. So we have two negative signs, which would turn into a positive. You can skip this step if you want to write positive right away y, we have the same base y. This is essentially y to the one. We're gonna have one minus four, since we have y to the one divided by y to the four is y to the one minus four. All of this, oh, to the exponent, four thirds. Now let's just rewrite this. This is negative 27 x to the 6 plus 3 is 9. This is y to the negative 3. All of this to the 4 thirds. So the next step is to, in simplifying this is to simply uh, distribute this exponent to each of these parts. So essentially we're going to write negative 27 to the 4 thirds which we can type into our calculator as follows. This is negative 27 to the exponent four divided by three equals 81. So we know that negative 27, the number part to the exponent four thirds is 81. That's this number part. Alternatively, we could have uh, rewritten this as negative three to the exponent three, since negative three times negative three times negative three it becomes negative 27. That's the same as this part here. And then this here, all to the exponent four thirds. So if we have this bracket four thirds, we see what happens with exponent bracket exponent. We multiply these. And we, when we multiply these, this is essentially three over one, the threes cancel out. So we get negative three to the exponent, negative three to the exponent four. So negative three times negative three times negative three times negative three, four negatives make a positive, which is positive 81. But we have a calculator, so we don't have to do that. So we now have x to the nine times so we're gonna multiply the, these exponents since we have exponent, bracket exponent. So this is x to the nine times four thirds. So the nine and the three cancel out and we get a three on the numerator. Three times four is 12. So three times four essentially is x to the 12. And when we look at our answers already, we have the coefficient 81, it's only c or d and x to the 12 is definitely going to be choice D. However, just for sanity's check, we're going to keep progressing here. So we're distributing this 4 thirds over here, here, and here. We're spreading the love. So now finally, we're working with the y's. We have y to the negative 3 exponent bracket exponent means we multiply these exponents. Negative 3 times 4 thirds. So here we have a, the three is cancel, canceling out. We have y to the negative four. Y to the negative four means the y ends up uh, being a positive four if you put it on the denominator, if you switch it from the numerator to the denominator. So certainly choice D is the answer. Excellent.